What's going on guys? Welcome back to yet another episode. So I'm really excited about this one. Hopefully you guys are too. So we are here actually in the Tree Viper room. Now I know I said I probably wasn't going to be filming in here too, too much, but I had to clear some space as you can see behind me. I got things moved around a little bit. Today I might have picked up some new friends. All right, so as most of you guys know, I am obviously building a zoo. So with this zoo comes a lot of water features and things like that. There's only one company that I actually trust to be able to get all of my water situations, well, situated, and that's this company here. All right guys, so we are here at Ciche here in the United States. This company is quite amazing, I must say. So this is their warehouse. As you can see, all the products they have behind me, this stuff is getting shipped all over the country. Um, my good buddy Steve, who pretty much runs the company here in the US, is actually getting paperwork ready because I'm here picking up three different pumps for future jobs I have for my own personal stuff. So seeing as we have so much stuff coming up uh, with the zoo, I'm going to have a lot of water features and everything is going to be CHA powered, so I'm really excited about that. Alright guys, so it's been about a day. I let this little tank behind me run uh, to kind of clear up the water and also put some dechlorinator in there as well. So let's talk about what new friends we got. So this is a new one that I don't have yet. It comes from South America. More preferably the Amazon and Orinoco Basin. The males only get about five foot long. Females only get about four and a half, maybe five foot, maybe foot long. So I'm really happy about this. I've been wanting some more of this particular species for quite some time. So, without further ado, I did get a pair of these. I show you guys the baby smooth front caimans that I just got. So I did get a pair, a male and a female. So they are gonna be living inside in this 55 gallon behind me. I'm really happy for these guys. They're also known as the Schneider's Dwarf Caimans as well. So they are a type of Dwarf Cayman, but they are not the same as Chomper because Chompers is a Cuvier's Dwarf Cayman. So really happy, really prehistoric looking little guys. Look at that thing. They're like jet black when they're babies. So I don't know which one's which yet, um, but they've been living in a tote for the past day. It's time to uh, put them in their little habitat. See, so yeah, I think it's pretty cool. 
I got some new uh, new caimans, new crocodilians. Um, yeah, I've been itching to get some new crocodilians for quite some time now. Um, but I do have a water heater uh, in the water portion of it, just so at night they can stay uh, anywhere around 75 to 80 degrees. And then they have a basking spot with a UVB bulb. Also, the basking spot is around 83 degrees. So. Pretty happy. I have it kind of rigged up right now with the white light for filming, um, but this is going to be a little temporary housing for them probably for the next uh, six or seven months. So something I was thinking about doing um, moving forward as we're opening up the zoo is maybe getting like a 75 gallon tank um, and making it basically a big paludarium for baby crocodilians. So I love getting baby crocodilians. I love raising them up. I think it makes you have a better relationship with those animals. So moving forward, I might add a big tank to one of the shelves here in the tree viper room for baby crocodilians, which I think will be really cool. So we'll see. But I'm gonna go ahead and get some food for these guys tomorrow. I'm gonna get them crickets. I'm gonna get them little pinkies. I'm gonna get a little fish to swim around in there with them so to see if they wanna hunt them. I'm really happy for these guys. Again, it is a pair of smooth front caimans from South America. Cool guys. They actually have big black dots all over their face as they get older. You can kind of see them now, but again, they're very, very dark still. So that's gonna be it for this episode, guys. I know it was short, I know it was sweet. I'm so happy I finally have some new crocodilians. So I will see you guys in the next video. Like always, remember subscribe if you are not already. Smash the like button if you haven't already. And stay tuned, because we are still building a zoo. I will see you guys in the next one. A big thank you to my Patreons. You guys are truly amazing. Bye.